I'm kind of old. True. My life's kind of boring. Also true. But I'll film it anyway. No one asked for this. Hope you're ready for it, cause I'm blocking till Christmas Day. Oh my god, please never let me do that again. Hello everyone, good evening. It's nighttime, we'll talk about that. And welcome to Vlogmas number 12, the final Vlogmas of 2022. I can't believe it. We, first of all, it is so dark in here. Okay, that's not much better. It's literally 4.30. You would think it was the middle of the night. <sighs> but we have had a little bit of a stressful, like the vlog is late. I meant to start it hours ago, but we've been dealing with a situation with our neighbors that aren't even in our building. It's like another building and like an animal. And like, I don't really wanna talk about it, but it was just like a really stressful last few hours. But anyways, we are on the last day of Vlogmas. I almost didn't even make this vlog. And so I'm glad that we're doing it. I just finished getting ready. We're gonna look at some Christmas lights tonight. We're gonna go like drive and look at some lights, walk around a little bit, do some festive stuff. It's actually been a few days since I filmed the last Vlogmas. I've been <laughs> so busy just trying to get things together for going home for christmas i got my nails done which was really nice i had a nice like self-care me day i had to take layla back to the vet that was a whole thing we almost had to take her back again this morning but she's doing fine right now um we've been watching a lot of christmas movies trying to catch up we watched a really really cute christmas movie on amazon prime that actually my friend margo on instagram recommended to me and it's a British movie that's called Your Christmas or Mine. And it was really corny and really cute. It has the same actor, Asa Butterfield, who is in Sex Education. So if you like that show and you like him, I think you would enjoy it. I thought it was really cute. There was actually quite a few actors in that that had been in other things that we had seen. So definitely recommend that if you wanna like add it to your list. But yeah, here we are. Got my hot red nails for Christmas. And now it's time to do the very last day of my advent calendar that I absolutely flopped at during this Vlogmas. Like, I feel like I did well in other ways during Vlogmas, but I did not keep up with this advent calendar. Drew ended up just like completely doing the rest of his, like he was over it. So, okay, let me set you down. And we will open our last day of advent which actually is two of them because it's number 12 and then it's also like a bonus gift i'm happy about that so okay number 12 oh it's like a perfume or something oh my gosh cute wait but what is it it doesn't say <laughs> what are you hello i don't know what it is but let's see what it smells like it smells really good it kind of smells like a lush like when you walk in lush okay don't mind if i do i'll do a little dabble oh I just spilled it. Okay, hold on. I need to wash my hands. It smells really, really good. Do you know what it smells like? It smells like either Chanel Chance or Chanel Coco Mademoiselle. I can't tell the difference, so it might actually be that. Because I wore Chanel Chance like all through high school, and <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what this is. It's very nostalgic. But anyways, okay. Now time for the bonus gift. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> It's $10 off your next $40 or more beauty purchase. Damn. <laughs> okay, well. Oh, it was a bonus gift. Yeah, that was the bonus, yeah. So anyways, okay, there we have it. Another oh, wow. year of Advent. Yeah, it's really cute. Another year of Advent done. Next year, we will definitely do like a food one as well. That one was like really fun to keep up with. <laughs> I heated a doll. <laughs> He's spilling my perfume everywhere. We also did our like Christmas morning together this morning. Um, we decided while we had some time, just the two of us, we would just do it now. Instead of like bringing all the presents with us back home, you know, in the car and stuff, we were like, let's just open our presents, have our own little Christmas morning. So the highlights of what Drew got me for Christmas, number one are these babies. <laughs> These are the cutest things I've ever seen. He got me the pink mini Uggs or the ultra mini. 
but they're so cute. I seriously can't wait to wear them. I'm so excited. And then also, both of us actually, like hilariously, got each other Ugg slippers, um, and they were a flop on both of us. So <laughs> Drew got me the Tasman, I think they're called, slippers, and they don't really fit my foot, and like, I also got him the same exact slippers and they don't fit his foot either. So You're literally like how cute are these? But they are so tight at the top of my foot. Like I literally can't wear them. And then same for him. I got him like the men's version, this one, and they suck. So those are both going back. It was so funny. Like we were trying them on at the same time and we were like, oh, I don't like them. The tree is looking absolutely lovely and glorious tonight. It actually smells so good. And I'm really proud of us for actually keeping a tree alive for this long because if you remember the last time we got a real tree a few years ago, it died. So pretty proud of us for that. So what we're gonna do now is go drive to Beverly Hills and then like take a walk around cause I think they have really cute lights on Rodeo Drive and stuff. So we're gonna like park, walk around, see some of the lights, maybe do a little bit of shopping. I don't know. I mean, depending on what the lines situation is like, not shopping on Rodeo Drive, oh my God. <laughs> Not to be confused, but there's like Sephora over there and like Starbucks and Lululemon and stuff like that. Um, but anyways, and this is Drew, one of Drew's um, Christmas presents that I got him. Look at this Yay. cute sweatshirt. He's a Penguins fan in case you were wondering. Look at your cute outfit. You look adorable. <laughs> Work. I think I'm actually going to wear these Converse because they kind of like match my sweater. Layla is back there, you know doing her thing as per usual. She was actually not feeling so good today. Anyway, we'll talk another time, maybe next year. I'm so excited to have our last little festive day. We actually did this when my dad was in town. I didn't like film any of it, so I thought it would be fun to go back again and just have a little festive evening. And then we actually have to come home and pack and wrap a couple more presents, you said? Yeah, is this a Chanel perfume? Yeah. My grandma used to wear Chanel. Let's go see some lights. Don't mind Layla in my outfit of the day or night. I got this sweater on thread up. I don't actually think I've worn it yet. And then I got these little like flare split leggings from Abercrombie last year and I've never worn them either. I have my cute little choker on from Missouri and I think these earrings are from there as well. My glasses actually are real and they're gonna help me see the lights a lot better. And then I'm wearing my mustard high top converse. Okay, now let's go. Look what we just happened to stumble upon. Time for me to shop for myself. And how very fitting. Look at the street name. Okay, this is kind of niche, but who remembers Kitson like from the early 2000s? I think I've mentioned this in a vlog before, but like I feel like this was the spot where you would always see like Paris Hilton shopping or Britney Spears or Lindsay Lohan or something. So it's just really funny. It's still alive and thriving. Maybe I'll go in there someday, but my imposter syndrome will not let me. Secured the bag, got two of my favorite decaf pods. Oh yeah, let's cut across. That was the fanciest coffee shop situation I have ever, they literally have like a coffee bar in there. And it felt so fancy, you have to like wait to be helped. I thought I was just gonna go in and grab like. It's almost like um, how Apple is. Yeah, like it's like an Apple store, <laughs> which I've never been in an espresso store before, except actually like one in England, but I didn't go inside. Jasmine and Alexa did, so I just felt like so confused, but yeah. 
got my decaf pods. She was like, should I recommend the boost that has extra caffeine? I was like, oh no, sorry, I'm looking for decaf. She was like, oh. <laughs> First time I walked past this, I thought it said Panera and I got really excited, <laughs> but it's not Panera. Imagine if all of these up here were actually apartments. I would die. I love it so much. I want to live here. I feel like these steps by Tiffany's are very iconic. We always see when we drive by, if we're in the area, we see like film crews here a lot and stuff. And right in front is this beautiful hotel with a Christmas tree. I love it. So cute! I love him. Okay, we are home from our little festive adventure. That was so fun. It's actually only like 6.15 right now, so it's still very early, which is good. Because we need to like fold our laundry, put some laundry away, and then also pack. Yeah. We have some more Christmas presents to wrap. We have a lot to do, but I thought in the meantime, while Drew is ordering us food, because we are trash, um, as usual, we don't really have any groceries. We have like frozen meat and we don't want to thaw anything. So we're ordering food. So quick Sephora haul. I literally got two things, three things. First thing, I'm going to take this with me. This is the Saint Tropez one hour advanced tan. It's like the dark one. And I like the ones that you don't have to leave on as long. And I thought this would be like nice travel friendly version. And I also got a new mitt because the other mitt that I have is getting a little crusty. So I got the Saint Tropez mitt. And then I saw this at the checkout because if you go to Sephora, you know, actually Drew pointed this out the checkout will get you with all the cute little things and this five or i don't know how many dollars hand sanitizer just really intrigued me it's like a really thin mist hand sanitizer mist me okay you want to try it and this yeah. is the rainwater scent by touchland and like look how sleek it is it can just fit right in your purse oh oh it smells really good yeah it's like uh okay more <laughs> cute Cool. But it'll fit great in my purse. So there's my Sephora haul. Our food is almost here and it is about that time. We have waited long enough and it is time to watch the best Christmas movie. Well, my top three Christmas movies of all time, which is The Holiday. Ah, oh, I can't wait. Well, come on then. You're not usually allowed to do this, but it's Christmas. Come on. <laughs> this is very cheeky. We do not recommend this, but she didn't feel good today. Look, we were just there! Most love stories are about people who fall in love with each other. everybody this lighting is ass i'm so sorry um i can't believe it we're at the end of vlogmas this vlog isn't super long but I, i'm we're, it's time to wrap it up we have so much packing to do we have to get ready to head out we're actually renting a minivan i think i mentioned this but we're renting a minivan to drive back to arizona for layla because it's like lower to the ground easier for her to get in and out of and then she can like sprawl out we're gonna bring like her big bed and she's just gonna like sprawl out the entire time so anyways we have a lot to do tomorrow and it's kind of like the last day of school vibes you know i'm just i'm cutting out early <laughs> but i appreciate you so much if you watched one vlogmas if you watched all of them if you've watched years past it means so much to me i've had 
so so much fun spending the month of December with you and we've done everything from like getting the tree to showing my dad around LA to going to Disneyland to seeing Christmas lights like so many fun things Christmas shopping you know I've just enjoyed it so so much and it's been so much fun I'll be curious to see what my vlogmas situation will look like next year um but yeah I'm just sending a huge thank you to all of you who have left really wonderful comments and have been here every other day until Christmas. I'm gonna take like the rest of the month and just spend time with like my friends and my family and enjoy my time back home. Enjoy my birthday. My birthday is on December 27th. So gonna enjoy that and just take some take some time. I need a break. I need to reset. I'm filled with so much gratitude for all of you and you mean the world to me. So that's gonna do it for Vlogmas 2022. I literally can't believe that we've gotten here. Like it just, it came and went in a flash. I literally feel like it was like Vlogmas day two the other day. Do you have anything you'd like to add? Merry Christmas, happy holidays. Love it. Happy New Year. You heard the man. Stay safe out there. He goes, stay safe out there. Not the finger guns. <laughs> <laughs> Lil and Moo send you all of their love and we'll see you in 2023. Literally crazy. See you then, bye. Merry Christmas, happy holidays. Give him one more bite. Bye. <laughs> Do that. <laughs> bye. <laughs>